Hey guys, Jim here with Comparing All. Now, I don't know about you, but all day long I hear arguments going on and on and on about which macaroni and cheese is better, Kraft macaroni and cheese or Velveeta macaroni and cheese. It's just back and forth, back and forth all day long. Don't you get those arguments? Well, today I'm going to settle this debate once and for all. I'm going to compare Kraft mac and cheese with Velveeta mac and cheese. Now, usually, when you make mac and cheese, you got to take the box and you've got to boil the macaroni and then you've got to put in the sauce and you got to mix it up and do all that, but I'm too lazy to do that. So luckily, I was able to find two instant bowls of macaroni and cheese, one Kraft, the other Velveeta. So here they are. Here is the mac and cheese from Kraft. Okay, let's do a little close up here. Kraft mac and cheese, okay? So I've already took, taken the liberty of uh, putting in the water and putting it into the, uh, into the microwave, heating it up, and then stirring in the sauce. Now here is the Velveeta mac and cheese, okay? So as you can see, very similar bowls here. Okay, both of the mac and cheese. Now, these, these are very, very similar, similar, these two types of mac and cheese. The only real difference is that the Kraft mac and cheese has these little tubes, as you can see here, whereas the Velveeta mac and cheese has these little shells, okay? And also, when you make these mac and cheese bowls, the, with the Kraft, what you have to do is you put in a cheese powder and you mix it up with the water after you microwave it. Now for the Velveeta, they have this pasty sauce, not a powder, a sauce that you put in there and you mix with the water and the mac uh, macaroni after you microwave it. So those are the main differences there. Also, as you can see, the Kraft is a little bit more orange in color, whereas the Velveeta is a little bit more yellow in color, okay? So you got that difference there. Now in terms of the nutrition information, you know, I'm not going to read everything here. They're both 220 calories if you eat the whole package. So I'm not going to eat the whole package of each, but um, in terms of everything else, you know, not a huge amount of difference here. We've got the Kraft at 3 grams of fat, whereas the Velveeta, well, it is a little bit more at 8 grams of fat. Uh, in terms of sodium, 470 milligrams here on the Kraft. And then for the Velveeta, we got 590 milligrams. In terms of total carbs, 41 grams on the Kraft, and we've got 30 grams on the Velveeta. So all in all, you know, they, it's a lot of give and take. They're pretty much uh, very similar types of mac and cheeses. So they're still hot, so I'm gonna go ahead and try them and tell you what I think. Okay, so let's start with the old standard, the Kraft mac and cheese. Okay, I've, I've, I grew up with this. I think all of you, or most of you have grew up with this as well. Uh, Velveeta came later. Kraft has always been around. It's always been a, a big favorite, okay, of kids uh, all over. Okay, so let's try it out. It's still hot, as I mentioned. I got my plastic fork here. Let's go ahead and take a look. It looks very, very creamy. It smells very good, just like when you uh, grew up. Let's take a look here. Here's a close-up look at this. Okay. Mmm. Brings me back to the old days. Really good. Now, there is a difference between this microwavable type and the type that you actually have to, you know, pour into a pot, boil, stir in the sauce and all that. There is a difference, but the difference is not huge. I mean, these instant macaroni and cheeses are not bad. Mm. Just like the old days. Excellent, excellent macaroni. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm a little bit partial to, to the tubes. I don't like shells as much, but, you know, they're, they're pretty comparable. So, this is very, very good. Very creamy, a very creamy taste to it. A little bit sweet, very, very cheesy. Although this is powder, it's very, very cheesy. Hmm, excellent. Love the craft. Who wouldn't love the craft? Okay. Now, Velveeta, of course, 
is probably the biggest competitor of, uh, of Kraft. Here, take another close look here. It's less fluorescent orange, and it does come, as I mentioned, in shells, and also the powder or the sauce that you mix it with is actual sauce, it's not powder. But let's see how that translates into taste. Okay, let's take a nice good bite here. Here you go. That's a close up right there. Okay. Mm. Very good. Mmm. Excellent. You know, actually, now that I'm tasting this side by side with the craft, I'm thinking that it does make a difference that this is made with the, the actual mixed sauce as opposed to powder. It's definitely creamier. Definitely creamier. Extremely cheesy, just like the craft, but even more so, I think, because of the fact that it's got this this very creamy taste to it. And the fact that they're shells as opposed to little tubes, I think doesn't make a huge difference, but I'm liking these shells a lot. Mm. You know, I hate to say it, I've always been a Kraft guy, a Kraft mac and cheese guy. Never really been a Velveeta guy, but you got to give it to Velveeta. It's pretty good. Mm. I think that seals the deal. I really do think that I prefer the Velveeta over the Kraft. And I didn't think this would be the case, but apparently it is. Okay, so how would I rate these two? You know, I've always been a Kraft guy. Velveeta was never really my thing. I never really tried much Velveeta, but now that I'm trying it side by side, I do prefer it. In terms of the comparing all rating scale of one to five, where five is the best, I would say when you're talking about mac and cheese, especially instant mac and cheese, I would give the Velveeta a good four stars, okay? And then the Kraft, I would slightly prefer the Velveeta over the Kraft. I would give Kraft about three and a half stars. Both solid macaroni and cheeses, but I would give Velveeta the edge because of the fact that it is cheesier, it is creamier, it's less fluorescent orange, and overall, it's more of a pleasant mac and cheese. Okay, thanks a lot, guys, and thanks for watching, and um, see you guys next on the next comparison review here at Comparing All. Thanks a lot.